I feel like pop smoke today. Dior, Dior, when it rains, it pours. Okay, anyways, on to the video. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, I'm Sheree. Welcome. If you happen to be returning, you are truly, truly appreciated. Thank you so much, and welcome back. Today, you guys, we are talking about Dior, honey. We are talking all things fabulous and fancy, and Dior is definitely fancy and fabulous, darling. Here on this channel, I do cover fashion, beauty, luxury, and lifestyle. If you like any of those things or perhaps you are like me and you too love and appreciate all things fancy and fabulous go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button smash the notification bell it will alert you every single time there's a video placed on this channel we're coming in no particular order we just have gifts and packages and we are coming to share with you Okay, so you guys, if you follow me on Instagram, and if you're not like, hello, how are you even saying we're friends? Hello, if you, I'm so excited. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I unboxed this. Did I unbox this on the channel? Oh no, I asked you guys if you could guess what fragrance it was, and all of you guessed it right. Okay, you know me so well. Yes, I picked it up. Here's what the packaging looked like. Oh my God. It, it came so beautifully packaged. I love the packaging here. It just looks so elegant and so luxurious. I was like, oh my God. The first time I didn't even know how to open it. It looks like that. The attention to details is everything. Absolutely love that here. And then we open it inside. Oh, I showed you guys that I got that already. And then and then it came with these beautiful, nice little samples here. These are the samples that I received. I received this one here that we spoke about. And this one is Rouge Tafalga. Received that one. And then I also received this one here. This is Grizz Dior. Love it. And then I also received this one here, which is one that is perfect for spring. And then I also received this one here inside here, Jean Dior. So this is good. Cute little pouch that it came in that it gives us to keep. And then of course, you know, I did receive this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Love, love, love. And this is like this absolutely gorgeous love the color of this juice i just cannot stress how beautiful it is inside it came with i guess a travel case in case you want to travel with it you can travel with it it came with like a little travel case which is really cute and then also it came with like a little dior pillow i like i don't know what that is i guess it's like a little pillow it's super cute save delicious i don't know how many times i've spoken about this fragrance already i'm just so excited to have it in my collection i think i unboxed it recently in a haul video but this is what it looks like here absolutely love it the color of the juice the bottle is heavily weighted it is a magnetic cap it is gorgeous darling on the channel i already have a full dedicated video to this one here which is fab delicious you guys so many uh dedicated videos to this one but this one smells really good it's really amazing i definitely get fall winter vibes from it um it is really really good it just smells rich classy luxurious so this one here highly highly recommended now let's look at some of the other ones that i haven't played with how cute is that i love the miniatures there's darling in case you're traveling or something or you want to take something with you or sometime you have holidays coming up and you want to give someone something and you just want to put a little cute extra touch in there these type of little uh boxes are perfect for that this one here is jasmine it's a fruity white floral and it's absolutely gorgeous if you're needing something very long lasting very sparkling very upbeat um it's simply gorgeous oh my gosh it's so good i have been looking for rose but this is giving it a run for its money because this is really good a few of the notes it's like i said it's a white floral it has jasmine that's what it is jasmine apricot and peach i'm obsessed with peach lately don't know where that's coming from either oak moss white musk and vanilla i put on my card after doing my wear test it is extremely long lasting absolutely love this one highly recommend getting a whiff of it i will leave all of the uh fragrances in the description box below because i know these are little samples it's hard to see but they'll be in the description box i move on here's another one that i spoke about grizz dior now that one was recommended by a lot of you you were like try it out i think charlene um from here on youtube i i know her by charlene um i don't know if that's her channel name but that's what she spoke about i believe she spoke about this you guys i can't be remembering who really said it but i think it was charlene charlene if it was you let me know leave it in the comment section i'll pin it so that they can check out your channel but anyways um you guys this one here is really another one that's really good this is just one of those that you just rub on yourself oh gosh it's good this makes me feel 
fancy. This is definitely brunch, afternoon tea type of vibes. Um, it's very good in longevity. All of these had a really good longevity. This is a rose fragrance too. It has rose in the opening, oak moss, patchouli, bergamot, sandalwood down in the dry down. It's really good. Would you buy this? It's good, it's rich, it's fancy, it's sophisticated, but I would want it to have a little bit something else in it. And you know where I get it? In Grise Charnel from Dior. I mean, no, from BDK. I think that I would prefer that one over this, but this is good. It's just, it, I, I wouldn't buy a full bottle of it. So I'm so glad that I have these little miniature samples because I love sampling and trying before I buy it. That I wouldn't buy today. Cause you know, I changed my mind a lot. You guys, let's just be honest. I do change my mind a lot. Today I wouldn't buy that one. It wouldn't be full bottle worthy for me, but it is good, but I wouldn't buy it. Okay, I move on. Amber Nuit. And if I'm saying that wrong, forgive me. Um, I, I, I may not know how to pronounce it. <laughs> just don't. Okay, so Amber Nuit, let's smell this one. Oh, I normally love this color juice. Oh gosh, that's good. Oh, see, Automat it has spice in it, right? Oh, it's so good. Yes, an oriental fragrance. It's so gorgeous, woody amber. Yes, now this one is good. Amber Nui, I like that one. That one, oh my gosh, it's so good. I would consider that to be full bottle worthy. I just like a spice. I like it hot. I like a kick. I like a oomph. I like a rrr. You know what? I don't know the name of what that's called, but that's what I like in my fragrances. Ooh, jot that down. Amber Nuit is really good. Okay, let's do another one. Rouge Tafalga. Let's talk about that one again. Although I spoke about it last year on the channel, I told you it was beautiful. I told you it was gorgeous. Perfect for spring, perfect for summer, zesty, fruity, cranberry, strawberry, orange, grapefruit all of the above citrus notes very nice it's a very happy upbeat girly kind of fragrance in my opinion it came out last year i believe it came out 2020 it's good you guys it's good um it's really fruity and zesty would it be full bottle worthy for me because sometimes i play with them a lot before I actually purchased them. But this I didn't even revisit. I only revisit it right now because they sent out this beautiful little sample here. It has cherry in it as well. This wouldn't be for me. Something in, okay, you know how Chanel, oh, follow me. Okay, you guys, follow me, you know. You know how Chanel has a certain type of aldehyde or something in their fragrances where you can tell that they have the Chanel DNA? Just from the few that I've smelt here from their private blend or private collection, it has something in it that almost smells like the smell that's in the makeup, um, in cosmetics, and I, I don't love it. It's, it's not for me. It's something that's there that I don't know what it is, but yeah, no. Um, yeah, Rouge Trafalga, really beautiful fragrance, full bottle worthy for her, um, not so much, but it is really nice, okay? I move on. Grand Ball, did I say that one? I don't know if I did or not. No, remember what I said. I can come back and change my mind about any of these, you guys. Okay, we are just simply playing and sniffing, okay? Let's see. Mmm. Grand Ball is good, okay. Okay, oh my God, okay, so see, I like it. I just like the heavier ones, that's what it is. I just like the heavier ones. Grand Ball, oh, that makes me feel fancy and rich. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, yes, oh, this is good. Okay, this is full bottle worthy. Uh, Grand Ball, in my opinion, full bottle worthy. Okay, I move on. Soulful de Soul. Girl, you and these names. Mm, let's see. Oh, oh my. Yes, I just like it hot and heavy. <laughs> oh my God, it's so good. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, this one is really good. I like it. Grizz Dior, not full bottle worthy for me, but really good. Rouge Trafalga, not full bottle worthy for me, but really good, beautiful for spring. Very nice, very nice. Grand Ball, full worthy for me. Full bottle worthy for me. It's really good. I like this one. Okay, so that's gonna stay over here. Amber Nui, full bottle worthy for me. Really good, spicy, sexy, definitely full bottle worthy for me. So full, this one here is another one really, really good. I would consider it to be full bottle worthy. Jasmine, this is another one, 
full bottle worthy. This is really good. Out of all of them, I'm not gonna make that decision because I don't know. I would have to play with them a little bit more. But this jasmine, this jasmine one here, you guys, it's really good. It's the peach note for me, okay? If you're able to get a whiff of this, it's the peach note for me. It smells absolutely fabulous, darling. Thank you guys for stopping by, playing with these Dior fragrances for me. I have a few more samples coming. I was thinking of ordering that whole set of, I believe it's like eight or 10. I can't recall how many, but I have, I think most of them. And I thought that you would be able to pick the ones that you want to put in there, but it already comes pre, um, pre-made, pre-selected with the ones that are in there. So I don't know, I might pick it up, I may not, I'm debating it. If there's any other fragrances from Dior that you would have me try or that you would recommend, please leave it in the comment section below. I love to hear from you guys, I love chatting with you. If we're not connected over on Instagram, guy, girl, boy, child, woman, human, what are you waiting for? Come over, pull up 2.5, say hello, and I will see you beautiful souls in the next video. Until next time guys, you know the drill, be blessed, stay fit, and stay fabulous. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.